Hell yeah, dude. Uh, <laughs> it's good to see you guys. <laughs> yeah, please give it up for Doe de Chanel. Uh, uh, Courtney's ass is so fat. Uh, we live together, right? <laughs> this is a compliment battle. <laughs> it's true. Dude. We live together, and uh, her ass is so fat. One time, uh, she sat on her she sat on her TV remote, and it played the movie Flubber. <laughs> Damn, dude, coming in strong. So well, yeah. Yeah. Give it up for the Cabbage Patch Man himself, Ryder Ollie, everybody. <laughs> Ryder's last name is Ollie. I feel like that's ironic coming from a guy that can't get off the ground. <laughs> his first name is Ryder because his parents knew one day he'd get a DUI and lose his driving privileges. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. <laughs> his, actually, his middle name is Ryder, his first name is Dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I have something for you, dude. Oh, if she gets too nasty, I'm bringing this joke out. Please work <laughs> out for me. <laughs> but for now. You know what I'm saying, dude? Thank you. You gonna have that. Uh, Courtney spent uh, a lot of time in Wuhan. She was teaching over there. Uh, uh, but don't worry, it was before COVID. Right? So uh, what that means, she was spending a lot of time in China before COVID, so luckily for her, she was still allowed to be racist to Asians. She said it in a COVID joke. <laughs> I knew it was a stretch, dude. <laughs> Fuck! Yeah, give me that one. Oh, All right, hi. Right. Uh, Ryder, um, believe it or not, Ryder does get laid a lot. I know, yeah, he does. We actually call him the Steph Curry of sex because he's uh, always hitting those threes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude. I didn't know we were getting personal. Uh, Courtney? Courtney was found uh, guilty of assault. Yeah, too much assault on all her goddamn food. <laughs> Fat bitch. <laughs> like death kept for Cartman over there. <laughs> Call me a fat bitch. Yeah, right. <laughs> Ryder, believe it or not, Ryder has an adopted sister from Russia. When you're a disappointing man, you get a mail order bride, but I guess when you're a disappointing son, you get a mail order sister. <laughs> yeah, dude. I tried. She's always getting stuck in the dryer, you know? By the way. <laughs> yeah, I'm an idiot, dude. I gotta sneak her out of there, you know? Uh, Courtney's husband loves her a lot. Oh, yeah. Give it up, Zach, dude. He rules, dude. Courtney's husband loves her a lot because despite. All the like crazy fucked up shit. Like that? Yeah. The crazy, she's fucked up on the inside, you know what I mean? But her husband loves her because despite all that, she's all white on the outside. He's a racist. <laughs> Thing, you know, it's pretty good. <laughs> Thank you. She wrote that one, so. <laughs> Ryder, why is it that every time I look at you, I'm like reminded, like, oh shit, I gotta do my laundry. <laughs> Your Ryder dresses like every day is laundry day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this was my dress-up outfit. Dude. 
I ran it by Courtney a couple times. I was like, do you think this is good enough? Uh, Courtney looks like Velma from Scooby-Doo, right? Uh, but instead of looking for her glasses and ghouls, uh, she's always hunting for scratch-offs and reasons to say the N-word. Okay, that's true, that's and a long you're one. trying to make me sound cool? <laughs> <laughs> You're pretty cool, dude. Look, uh, when you go on a date with Ryder, you never know where you're going to go. But you do know it's going to be an all-you-can-eat establishment. <laughs> <laughs> Ryder looks like his daily mantra is, are you going to eat all that? <laughs> <laughs> Took this bitch on one date. <laughs> <laughs> okay, crush me. Uh, Court, uh, Courtney's a Disney adult. <laughs> yeah, she's a Disney adult, but she's the kind of Disney adult that gets drunk and jerks ju uh, <sighs> a juice. Juice? I jerk juice. <laughs> she jerks juice again. off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not Disney, you know? They, they hate him over uh, there, okay? Let's start it over. Um, <laughs> Courtney's a Disney adult, uh, but she's the kind of Disney adult who gets drunk and jerks Goofy off on the teacups. <laughs> I got through it! <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Why do I feel like you both would go, uh -huh, when you come? <laughs> It's so close, it's crazy. Final jokes. Uh, final jokes, huh? Oh, this is our final yeah. jokes. You can yeah. keep going. You want more from them? <laughs> <laughs> well, you have more jokes, dude. Do as many as you guys want. Ryder looks like he quit being Amish because of internet porn. <laughs> and I just look like an Amish hipster, like someone asks you your favorite Bible verse, and you're like, it's obscure, you probably never heard of it. <laughs> Like he went to a black barber and was like, give me that Ezekiel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, uh, Courtney is half black. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Courtney is half black, but she spent all that time in Wuhan. Uh, that's why she always bows before she robs me. <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> it's a good one. Uh, Ryder's a math tutor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right, kids. If you're good at math, you can grow up to be like Ryder. <laughs> hey, Ryder, what was your specialty? The Pythagorean theorem? <laughs> that's the best joke of the night, you fucking retards. <laughs> I'm sorry. Pythagorean theorem is the best. What are you doing? Why are you here? <laughs> all right, all right. Fucking I got one idiots. more. I got, yeah, you do All right, I got one more. Wait, give me the nasty one, dude. Yeah! Uh, uh, Courtney is such a fat bitch <laughs> that she's lactating from all six nipples. <laughs> Hey, by the way, the joke I gave this idiot is just a dick picture, dude. Because <laughs> I'm a fucking professional, dude. What the fuck? I'm gonna leave it in his hands? Come on. Jesus Damn, Christ. Damn, another fat joke, dude. He's going from John Daly's caddy over here. <laughs> Looking like Jimmy Buffet. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Ryder's ex, uh, this is a true story, Ryder's ex-girlfriend <laughs> was diagnosed with cancer. And then she dumped him. Because after six months with Ryder, she realized she wanted to die alone. <laughs> All right, give it up for that! <laughs>
and tell them I'd love to hear from you. Holy shit, give it up for them one more time. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I want to give it up for Courtney for just dressing like she's going to merge in with a bachelorette party that she's not actually a part of tonight. <laughs> And take it over. There we go. And I also want to give it up for Ryder for dressing like he's showing up to custody court and he really wants to lose those kids. <laughs> They're so expensive, dude. <laughs> I honestly love this because it felt like uh, I love that Steffi said let him keep going because I was like I would not want to cut this off and I, the whole time when you let him keep going I was like please tell me he's going to go to the nasty joke that he gave that kind of girl <laughs> go to the nasty joke that was so much fun uh, I love that you did the triple word score on one joke Courtney where you like had three jokes and one joke and you really crammed it in there uh, and that's something I bet he really likes uh, so uh, I really like it <laughs> you, just, you just got it right you just got it yeah it took me a second. Yeah, you, you burned too many brain cells vaping and drinking, idiot. All right, so no. No, I'm going to go with Courtney. It was absolutely fantastic. Ryder, that was an incredible performance. Thank you. I'm going with Courtney. One for Courtney. Harry, can I hear from you? Whoever has a microphone, honestly. Uh, this, this is one of the weirdest ways I've ever seen two people be horny for each other. <laughs> this was, why was this so horny? It was very, like, Ryder, come on, like, please, be a gentleman, okay? Her crow's feet are up here. Uh, it's, <laughs> uh, it's, I do, oh, damn, dude. Two, two Kevin's writer. What the fuck are you wearing? You, you, right now, you are wearing a T-shirt with four holes in it, more than with several cigarette holes. You wearing swim? Clothes. I lost my other shirt. You, lo you I had a. This is. I had an two shirts. Shirt. This is the other yeah, shirt. Yeah, yeah. And you decided to pair that with swim trunks and a rain yes, jacket on just the hottest day of the year so far. It was wet. <laughs> it was wet out. I. At what point in your dress splash. today did you make a decision? Like, I, I don't know. I, Ryder, I, you did an envelope bit. Uh, if you've been at Roast Battle before, you know I love prop envelope bits. So I, I feel like we're kindred spirits in that sense, and I, I loved that bit, and I love a drawing of a penis, but I think Courtney's jokes were... Oh, nice. you son of a bitch. I thought you had that one. Too you let me on, dude. Yeah. 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 Uh, Fujiko, I'd love to hear from you. They smell like a porno. And <laughs> <laughs> like the hot teacher and the special needs kid. <laughs> <laughs> but you are the teacher actually in real life. That's uh, pretty impressive. It was a great, great battle. Amazing work. Uh, everything was so funny, so I don't even know what I wrote. <laughs> but I remember like, you guys love laundry a lot. And go to like a laundromat or something. Um, I'm going for Courtney. Courtney! She was amazing. All right. So very good. But he was really good too. Yes, of course. Okay, well, Riley Cosgrove with the final thoughts. Definitely the best roast of the night. Yeah, give it up one more time, you guys. Definitely. Yeah. So Not in question, dude. Oh. First of all, Courtney is hot as fuck, so fuck you, you fucking pedophile looking motherfucker. <laughs> Dude, Why don't you just go be off on a fucking CTA bus <laughs> and make sure I'm there because I'm desperate. <laughs> I bet you shoot a nasty load. Um, yeah, it's, it's real so gross. It's like it's Chernobyl. Chunky. It's fucking bad. It's thick. You know? It's chunky. And um, <laughs> it comes out in spurts. <laughs> okay, you're right. I hate you. I hate men. But uh, Courtney all the way, definitely. Of course. Uh, all right, you guys. Well, what a hell of a battle to finish out on. You guys, give it up for yourselves for coming out to Roast Battle tonight. Give it up for your panelists one more time. Kevin Kellum, Fuji hey. Kelly, and Riley Cosgrove. You guys, we are here the first and third Thursday of every month, so please come back and see us. Join our uh, emailing list and follow us on all of our socials and zanies and all of that so you don't miss a beat here. Uh, please wait until your servers have uh, dropped off your checks and signed them for them. Give it up for your servers tonight, too, you guys. For the staff here at Zanies for letting us come here and talk shit all night, you guys. And we have a merch table, so don't forget to stop by our merch table with Micah. 
Michael. Hey, thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago. If you guys want to subscribe to our channel, you get even more content, a bunch of it, hours of it for free. And you can hit that little like button down there, hit the subscribe right over here, and check out these videos right over here.